Hi, I'm Dr. Birkenstock, owner of Skin Body Health in Mandeville, Louisiana and New Orleans, Louisiana. Today we're going to be talking to you about reclaiming your complexion via laser and chemical peels. So, first of all, do we ask, is every peel the same as every other peel? Well, the answer obviously is no, it is not. So I can put a lot of different acids on your face, from a salicylic acid to a glycolic acid, and I can make a hot mess. Much like my face is today, we'll get a close-up of that later, because I'm in the midst of a chemical peel. However, if a chemical peel is going to do more than just char the surface, and then make that layer peel off, you look in the mirror two weeks later and go, got through the process, mm, I think I look a little better, but then maybe three weeks or six weeks out, you look in the mirror and go, I went through a whole lot and I'm not seeing a whole lot of result. So what I have always focused on in my clinic is to delivering procedures that give tried and true proven results. So if we're going to put you down and give you some downtime and flaking and redness and everything where you're wearing gels and creams on your faces, getting through that sort of peeling phase like I'm doing right now, we want to make sure that when you come out of it two months, three months, six months, years later that you go, I love that I did it because I got that fabulous result. So let's remember, when you're doing a light peel, um, you know, maybe at a little med spa or with an esthetician that's like a glycolic or salicylic, by and large, in most cases, not all, you're getting a very superficial the, uh, peel on the epidermal or the very lightest or topical surface of the skin. If we're going to go down a little further, we really need a medical grade product. There's a medical grade product that I particularly love and that's amino levelonic acid, nicknamed PPIX for protoporphyrin 9. PPIX is a fabulous medical uh, complexion chemical peel. Why is it so fabulous? Well, number one, this chemical peel was invented for or developed for precancerous and cancerous skin lesions. So if the squamous cell or basal cell carcinoma on the face, you can absolutely eradicate that with the use of this peel. So for example, we put this peel on, we leave it on from one and a half to two hours. Uh, this is much in the casing that it looks like. And when we apply this, let it incubate, kind of feels like a little bit of an alcohol pad going on. Then we incubate it with two or even sometimes three different type of lasers. And we're going to do a demonstration on that in a little bit. And what happens then is the chemical goes inside of the skin and basically making it in very simplistic terms, it's going to look for any cells that aren't nice, round, and plump like a teenager's skin cell. And whether it's a precancerous or a cancerous lesion or a blown out skin pore, an enlarged skin pore, a wrinkle in formation, or maybe even bad texture or the beginning of bad texture on the skin, it's going to soak into those bad skin cells and eradicate them or make them slough, slough, and slough off again over the process of a week. So right now I'm in day four of my chemical peel and as you can see, I'm sloughing off skin cells and it looks like I'm peeling from a bad sunburn and for all likelihood it looks that way and is that way. So you can still go on about your daily business. It's a little uncomfortable, it might be a little itchy, but you can go on and do what you need to do. At the end of about a week, it could be anywhere from six to nine days, depending on the person, when you come out of this, you've got an absolutely renewed skin complexion. Your cells are different, your pores are tighter, beautiful looking skin. And the reason why I did this webinar tonight, I always do my chemical peels in the beginning of every summer. Uh, this particular summer I'm a little late, but, and the reason I do that is because every year we need to renew our complexion. We're always exposed to the environment, to the sun, to smog, sometimes to smoke and it takes a deleterious effect on our skin. So when we turn over those skin cells, 
with a product like amino level lonic acid, what happens then is we're able to renew those skin cells. So there's not a week that goes by that somebody doesn't ask me, what do you do to your skin and how do you keep looking so young? I, 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 I thank everyone for those kind compliments and we were all our worst critic, but I would, don't think I would be fair if I didn't share that this is one of the things that I do. And most, most dermatologists and plastic surgeons do. It's an absolute win-win. Side effects, minimal to none. You've got to put up with a little bit of sunburning, a little bit of maybe uh, 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 lots of peeling, and maybe a, an occasional blister or so, although most of the times I've never gotten that. But what you get at the end result is a rebuilding of that skin matrix. The epidermis, the dermis, the beginning superficial layers of the skin, as well as some of the lower levels of the skin. And if there were any precancer lesions that were going to come out and haunt your skin later with a basal cell cancer carcinoma or a squamous cell cancer carcinoma, we're going to kill those so that you never, uh, in, in all prudent pres uh, presence, have to have those cut out. They're destroyed be before they can become something uh, that's confounding uh, you, your life or your uh, face. Please like and share our webinars to be included for a free bottle of Floral Sea Cleanser. One of the things we know about Floral Sea Cleanser, as we'll be promoting in, in a moment, is there's a certain select group of skincare products in our skincare line, Dr. Birkenstock Skin Body Health, that are great after any procedure or if you happen to have really super sensitive skin. So the Floral Sea Cleanser is a, a rose hip cleanser made from rose petals. And it's very, very um, chic, sensitive, smells wonderful naturally, no added preservatives or smells, very gentle on the skin. So please like and share to be included for a free rose hip sea cleanser. And remember, all of our YouTube videos, we speak to you guys uh, at least twice a month, and they're all on our YouTube page, Dr. Birkenstock Skin Body Health. We talk to you about anti-aging, weight loss, skin, hormones, uh, COVID, and, and the like. So please visit us at our YouTube channel. We always love to be here to educate and help you. Um, you can click in the description below to our product store to see the Rose Hip Sea Cleanser or any of our skincare or vitamin supplement bundles. If you missed any of our previous webinars, they're all logged on that uh, YouTube channel, Dr. Birkenstock Skin Body Health. So when we're talking about this product, amino levolonic acid, it's, it's known as a photosensitizer. In other words, it's a beautiful chemical that once it comes in, it incubates. Then with light, a photosensitizer, whether it's daylight, which daylight is hard to um, uh, get a handle in terms of how much daylight, how much intensity, how many minutes, etc. But in some countries, they actually do use plain daylight to intensify this product. In most clinics, however, we would use either the IPL or the BBL, which we'll demonstrate in a moment, or and or the uh, radio frequency microneedling laser, which we've got right here. So years ago, we used to only use the BPL and IPL to, uh, as well as the blue uh, collagen laser or blue light laser, to take this product into the skin, process it, turn over those cells, and come out with new beautiful skin. What we now know is that with radio frequency laser, so this isn't just a radio, uh, excuse me, a microneedling pen. Just open one, open. It's not just a microneedling pen, but it's a microneedling pen. Uh, there's 25 gold-plated needles, which these needle prongs come through every time we administer a laser pulse. So in addition to the microneedles, we also have a laser coming up through the machine, so you're getting microneedling and, and lasering, so you're actually getting a, an extenuated or synergistic response. This, in combination with BBL or IPL, which we will demonstrate, gives you a beautiful, beautiful um, chemical laser peel response. The before and afters are absolutely amazing. In a few minutes, we'll be bringing on one of our clients, uh, Miss Leslie, 
And Miss Leslie, we've got her befores and afters, which we will put up on the YouTube channel in the video. And absolutely phenomenal uh, dis distinctions between her befores and her afters. When we started with Leslie, she had a lot of pigmentation, a lot of wrinkling, uh, brown spotting, and just different discolorations amongst the skin. She's an avid boater and a uh, beautiful lady. Just need a little bit of a complexion renewal. When we come over here, we can see the intense wrinkling and under the eyes, some brown pigmentations on either side of the face. On this side of the face, this shows her approximately four days after the same chemical procedure I have on my face now. And as you will be able to appreciate online when we place this, on the interior of the face by the nose where she's already sloughed off, she's completely beautiful, bare, pink new skin, tightened pores, gorgeous, all the pigmentation is gone. On the outer aspects of the face, face the rough brown pigmented, all of the freckling, all of the H spots, um, and, and the pores are, are sloughing off and then turning in again to this bright new pink recollagenized Titan pore skin. And the pink will fade over time, but that pink is just accentuating to us what we have done to the skin and that we're rebuilding the collagen and elastin cells. We've also done her neck and decollete, as you can sort of appreciate in these photos. Here's her perfect example of a perfect patient, compliments to Miss Leslie, where she's out on the boat, she's got her hat, her shades, and her uh, 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 skin protection with zinc and or titanium. We'll show you some current photos of her. She absolutely looks great. You'll be able to see her in a moment when we bring her uh, uh, on live with Zoom to give us a little bit of her uh, to share with us. We've also got another client, Miss Alexa, and Miss Alexa started out very young, beautiful woman. And, I think these would be better if we put them online. And you can see she had a lot of uh, pigment uh, on the nose, forehead. She was an avid uh, soccer player when she was young. And in here, beautiful girl. A lot of pigment in a very young woman. So of course we wanted to get control of that as soon as possible. So that would not become um, more emphasized as an adult and as through pregnancy when the hormones are surging. Here's a picture of her after her laser chemical peer. You can see or maybe appreciate, again, we'll put these online and on our YouTube channel, zero pigmentation on the nose, the forehead, the cheeks, absolutely totally gone after her chemical laser peel. So without further ado, I'm going to first show you if you have a chemical laser peel. This would be what we would recommend as the bundle. The bundle is on sale and uh, marked down to $215. And we will also send you a complimentary travel size of the Rose Hip Rose Cleanser. So this combination includes the Rose Hip Rose Cleanser, the Satin Seal Moisturizer, which is great, does not sting, has no alcohols or preservatives after any procedure, um, our sunscreen with titanium or zinc, a sunscreen without titanium or zinc, which has both, is absolutely useless after a procedure because the sun rays can get in and redo the damage that we just took away. A sunscreen is not a true sunscreen or sunblock unless it's got titanium and zinc. Anything can block redness, but the destruction caused by the x-rays to your skin is only, uh, is only blocked by titanium and or zinc. Then Ageless Duo A and B, all the pigment, reds, rounds that we've removed, the wrinkling that we've improved, the texture that we've improved, we're able to keep that with Ageless Duo A and B. Use these together a night, a drop of both, mix them both in your hands, and add a little, a dash of satin seal moisturizer, you apply it at night, and that keeps the wrinkling down. It's a retinol based product, so it's got vitamin A in it, and the active ingredients, which absolutely improve texture wrinkling and discoloration. So this little subset of products called uh, Complexion Renewal um, is a wonderful, if you've got super sensitive skin every day, every night, or if you're one of those people that has just come out of any kind of procedure, a chemical laser peel, a laser, uh, or any other sort of procedure that you've had at your med spa, esthetician, or physician. 
we're going to have that marked down all the way through July. It's in, it's in our um, product store at SkinBodyHealth.com. You'll also get a free companion size of rosehip seed cleanser. Great, again, for anybody with super sensitive skin, it will is non-comedogenic and will not break you out. So right now what I'm going to do on our lovely client, Miss Stacy, is she's got some pigmentation issues and what we have done is we've already put the chemical on. As you can see, she's not in any pain or discomfort. Feels a little bit like alcohol when it goes on. And we've let it sit on now a couple of hours. So we're going to take the laser gel, place a little bit on her cheek. And what we're really working on, we're going to tighten some pores for Miss, uh, for Miss Stacy, and we're going to work on some of these uh, dark brown spots in her complexion. And of course, any little mock, little wrinkling we're going to go after as well. So you, this can be followed with an IPL or a BBL laser on top of the amino levelonic acid. Then I also like to follow up with the radio frequency microneedling laser, as I showed you before. When you do that, you just got an absolute home run. The complexion is going to change dramatically, and you're going to renew, reclaim your beautiful complexion. Okay. Ordinarily, I'd wear my laser goggles, but just for this demonstration, I've closed my eyes. But please know, lasers are dangerous and you must never uh, shoot a laser uh, by the client or yourself without proper laser goggles. But just for sheer demonstration, I've done two pulses. And I'm going to finish her more after our show tonight. We'll go over her entire face. But as you can see, it did not bother her. It is not painful. Um, it is certainly tender that evening when you're turning red and, and beginning to peel over the next ensuing days. But it is not painful when we're actually uh, doing the process right now. And she's had some numbing cream on her as well. Thank you, Stacy. We'll send you over to the next room and we'll come and complete your treatment in a moment. Thank you. Thank you. So this treatment is wonderful for photo damage, so if you've got sun damage or hormone damage, uh, etc., uh, or enlarged pores or anything that may be upsetting your complexion. Now, I also do younger people, uh, younger people and middle-aged people, and maybe they don't have enlarged pores, maybe they do from acne or acne scars, but what I do with a lot of younger ladies and gentlemen is I treat them for um, uh, acne. So not only is this a wonderful uh, chemical for photo damage, aging, anti-aging, menopausal changes in the skin, textural changes, but it's also good for acne, acne scars. It will go, that chemical will go down, and in this young gentleman, we've got some acne that, that, that forms down by his beard level and a little bit along the hairline. So we would put the chemical on, on him, the amino levelonic acid. It goes on again, much like water, much like alcohol, maybe a slight, uh, feel a slight sensation, much like if you were putting alcohol on your skin. And we let it incubate a couple of hours. If we were doing a neck or decollete, like we did do in, in Miss Leslie, what we would do is let it, the neck or decollete, or hands, arms, or legs, we let them soak overnight. On a face, we do one to two hours, depending on the client, okay? Then we come back with the lasers. And with acne, this amino levelonic acid goes down into the sebaceous glands. Sebaceous glands are just a fancy big medical word, meaning the glands that hold the inflammation, the, the gradu, the pus, the oils, that then come out and form either cystic acne or blackheads or whiteheads or pimples with a head sort of a thing. So we're going to put this goggle uh, on Anthony. He's already had numbing cream applied. And what we're going to show, that's to protect his eyes, and what we're going to show you guys is, even in younger people, it's, it's not a, a, a very big blast, not at all highly uncomfortable.
young man, I always let them tell me whether I, they would like me to do their whole face or just the acne prone regions. It's always better to do a whole face because if you do just a forehead or just a chin and then they begin to break out around the nose or around the mouth or mustache area, you know, it, it's, it's time and money for them. So I always offer the full face, but we'll go ahead. And So you can see it was very comfortable for the patient. Uh, it, it didn't, it didn't, uh, as long as you've got a little bit of numbing cream, um, it's, it's usually something they don't feel at all. So you would apply the amino levolonic acid, you would let it set in an hour or two, then you would come back with your IPL and or your radio frequency needling laser, and it's just a, just a home run, beautiful um, treatment for acne, acne scars, rosacea, and, and all of the like. Thank you so much, Eve. And remember, if we were doing this uh, in clinic, we would always protect not only the practitioner's eyes, but as we did also the client's eyes as well, and make sure anyone in the office uh, was, was um, protected with their eye area. Ready to call? Mm -hmm. So now we're going to call, thank you so much, Anthony, thank you. We're going to call Miss Leslie. Miss Leslie planned on being with us tonight, but uh, due to uh, current day situations, we're going to do this via online, via the web. Mm -hmm. I should come close to you, huh? Mm -hmm. Hi, Miss Leslie. How are you this evening? I am good. I'm good. Let's see if I can turn up the volume here. Right side. Right side. Top button. This is going to be a poor connection. Just one second. We're getting it revised. Miss Leslie back on. Unfortunately, the, we lost the connection. There we go. We got you back. Well, thank you for being with us tonight. Oh, you're welcome. Um, can you tell us a little bit about how your experience was with this uh, amino levolonic acid chemical peel procedure versus maybe anything else you may or may not have done over the years? Well, you know, it's basically just in skin care is really all I've done over the years, and I had no expectation of what to, what was going to happen to me, and it was absolutely unbelievable um, when I saw the results that we've all said and done it. Um, um, you know, I, the pores, um, age spots, wrinkles, and I absolutely have noticed a change in wrinkles um, above my lip and um, my neck. And so I am very excited about that. And then, like you know, I've talked about the discolorations and things that have changed, the smoothness of my face is just unbelievable. So it's been a wonderful experience. Oh, it good. looked too pretty. Yeah, yeah. It's been I know. I'm kind of sharing that lizard look right now, kind of peeling, peeling, peeling. Um, and has anybody in your friends, have any of your friends or family noticed a change? Without question. Two people actually noticed a change, and one person specifically commented, obviously, on the smoothness of my skin and my neck, mm -hmm. and which is pretty awesome because I have put nothing on my face except these sunscreen, tinted sunscreen. That's all I put on my, um, you know, Right, right. Well, you look great, Leslie, and that, that's, that's our tinted pure mineral sunscreen, huh? Uh, thank you. 
Exactly. Yes, yes, yes. You look wonderful. Thank you for visiting with us tonight. Uh, I, I'm not the best at audiovisual, but I, I do ap <laughs> appreciate you being here. You look fabulous. We're so glad that you trusted your care to us, and uh, we look forward to seeing you again. Right, thank you. Thank you. Take care. Okay, bye-bye. Well, once again, thank you guys for joining us as always. Live demonstrations are always a little bit hard to get exactly technologically accurate. Uh, we, we certainly don't have a um, production studio here. But we thank you for tuning in. We hope we gave you some good information tonight. And as always, we'll be back in a couple of weeks. We appreciate you. If you have any questions, let us know. And uh, you can always go to our YouTube channel, Dr. Birkenstock Skin Body Health. Good night.